All right, well, hello everyone. Welcome back again to Grounded. We're back again, as you can see. And in the last episode, we did a few things. We went around. We got some. We made this, which we now have silk rope. We need to head back to the analyze room and see what we can analyze. And in the last episode, we kind of explored around. We tested out the third person. I feel a lot more confident in third person, but at the same time, the game is still scary. Like, oh, bro, I'm constantly on edge now like bro my feet are tingling you know i'm having to look around you know the the awareness is like really high and it kind of i don't know for me in general it kind of just off puts me the game because I, I don't know i want to play this game like but at the same time i don't want to one thing i do want to do is i want to see how um how much like the arachnophobia safe mode i kind of want to try and see how that like effects you know see if um if it actually helps me <laughs> as it should but um we'll only change that when we do come across which i'm hoping we don't i'm just gonna live bro there's a lot of like bugs around and stuff okay so what i do want to do today is that i want to try and discover new weapons so i can do a little bit more damage and there's one thing that i wanted to try out and that was to go back I want to go and explore. Should we just do that now? Yeah, let's do it now. So we're going to go back over to the where the laser was that we fixed. We would also go and explore the cave to dig out the holes. See, look, I'm on. I'm just looking around. Right, I'm going to go in here. Go in here. Equip torch. Okay, well... The music was playing for threat. Or was that just there? So here... Uh, we're going to go deep in this cave. And hopefully there's some... So I remember when I was down here before... There was little, like, grubs... That I could see in the ground. I don't know if there's any here. That used to be... Um, here, like in here. That actually might not be grubs. And they might be lavas. So, okay, that's a grub. Kind of testing to see if I can find one. That is not a grub. Because I remember when I was down here the first time, and I encountered... Mm, it's not that. I encountered, like, lavas, which had little, like, fangs and stuff, which I'm thinking might be able to use as weapons. But that doesn't appear to be here. I need a rank 2. I don't know. I'm going to need a smithing station, I think. See, I'm kind of just, like, lost as to what I need to do. Um. So. I am, like, very curious as to what. I need to do. If I go up here, I get like a little bit of a high vantage point, maybe. Because I, I do want to explore. I do want to explore. And I do want to see if I can discover some new things, at least, that might help me. But at the same time, I'm not looking to get, like, eaten. Now, one thing I do know is I do have the... Because uh, I feel like I could probably... Is that down there? There's like something glowing down there. Um, do you think maybe I could get on the rake? Kind of just looking. Because um, the hedge is over there. Like that's where we need to go. But it's like really far away. Hmm. I'm kind of curious. Ah, see, this is the thing. Like I'm curious, but at the same time, I'm not. Okay. We're going. We're going. What is that? What the heck is that inside? I mean, it looks like a lava, but it doesn't look right. Like, in the slightest. Thank <laughs> you. 
Whoa! Jesus Christ, that scared the crap out of me. <laughs> I heard the music and I heard the thing it said threat detected and I'm just like... God almighty! <laughs> Is it coming? I'm kind of stuck here now. It's going to be night time as well. You know, I'm tempted to literally just sit in the dark and wait until night time. I think I could take this off. Is this, like, dark? I mean, there's, like, light here. Okay, you know what I'm going to do? So I'm going to immediately go. I'm going to go and just run back home. We know it's in... I'm just going to go run home, and I know it's in this direction. I can't see anything. Okay, I see. Alright, well, I made it back. Okay, we're literally waiting for one more silk rope. I don't know what I can make with silk rope. Uh, I don't know. I need to, uh, yeah, I need to analyze it. I just want to see if I can make this. Should I just make this? There's some Kapu crafted red ant parts increases hauling capacity. So maybe that might provide me more defense than the hat. Okay, and I've got the acorn chest plate, which I don't know what it does. What does it mean by major threat? Chunky tools are pretty catch from acorn bits that insects find delivered in heavy armor. And this is fuller and light armor. So if I remove the clover shin guards, although it says I need to craft some clover shin guards, so maybe if I just craft another one. Thing rods, craft. Okay, so I've done that objectives, but now I got two shin guards. <laughs> but I have no idea what to do to them. And I don't know if I can do anything to them. Right, I want to see if I have enough to make. Um... Oh. I've just grabbed all the stuff. Damn it, I want to put it. So, boosts maximum stamina, so I can make grub lichens, which is medium armor, acorn, which is heavy armor, and I can make more crude rope. Oh, I'm out of crude rope. You're actually serious. Is there no more plant fiber anywhere? Nope. I have used all of my plant stuff. Great. This is absolutely fantastic. Right, so now the silk rope is done. So now the next thing to do is to sleep. I'll wake up in the dark, but you know what? That's fine. Because we'll just wait naturally. Because it's almost... So find the grave robbery burgle chip. Complete trail marker at Trowel Gulch. And find the hedge lab and retrieve a super chip. So I've got grub roast, grub roast, grub roast. Let me just go and eat that. Cool. This third person's actually like really helpful. One thing I will say is I don't has it ever rained here? I'm kinda curious if it like rains. <laughs> uh right, so see I want I want better technology. But I don't know if I can. Oh, that's what it's attacking. I can see that now. <sighs> okay, it's now daytime. My uh, thing has changed. It's just following around. Okay, so I don't exactly know where to go. We need to head... We need to head to the H. Not the H. The hedge. 
that's where we need to go. So I don't know if it'd be better to go around the pond. I think it's closer that way, but I definitely know there's like spiders and stuff that way. Which might be a test to see if the arachnophobia safe mode will help me. I granted it'll still like scare me, because even these little like buggers down here will probably... Like the ants and the weevils, they still scare me half to death just because of the sound they make and, you know, what they are. And it's just like a sudden noise, a sudden sound, and to know that some may attack. So, with that being the case... Whoa, look at the sun! Mad! Alright, this guy's buggering me. Go away! Hey, bro, what are you doing, man? See, I protect some of the wildlife, but obviously... Alright, okay. So now, let's analyze the spoiled meat and see what we can make for that. Spoiled meat slurry. I've leveled up, though. Brain power. Peblet dagger. Gill tube. Okay. Right, here we go. Spiderweb, this is the one thing we've been lurking for. Insect axe, dew collector, spider fang dagger, and insect bow. Great, so as far as I'm concerned, I can't do anything with the spiderweb unless I have other stuff that I need from other animals that are going to probably kill me. Fantastic. I'm happy that this happened. It's good to know that I don't seem to be getting anywhere in this game. Like, at all. Uh, ladybug over there. I don't know, do animals, like, fight? Like, if I were to stick near... Like, like say if I was to, meant to stick... Like, if I was to stick near a ladybug, would, it, would and a spider would arrive, would the spider fight me, or would it fight the ladybug, or would the ladybug help me, like... That's another thing I'm curious about. Alright, well I need a bit of water. Because, like, the hedge is literally in the far corner of the map. Oh dear. Landed straight into the pits there. Was there anything wrong with this laser? Was there anyone at this laser? Because I know there's like spiders hanging around that laser over there and obviously that laser we go into. I, have I been here? Is that water or is there something in the distance there? See, I'm just trying to have a good time, but it's just this, just the game puts me on edge and I can't like trust it, you know? Okay, right. So let me take let me take my time to gather my thoughts here. Okay, it's just these guys running. See, I need to like have a firm eye to identify like what is what round here. Cause any sort of noise is gonna like really do me dirty here. Like, I need to look out for the noise. I need to identify what noises from which animal. So, in the event that something does come, or if I do hear something in the background, if I can hear it makes a creature similar to that, that, that of a weevil, then I know it's a weevil and we're blessed. But if not, that's where we're going to have our issues. Oh. Ding, 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 ding. That's interesting. Where's that then? Oh. Got stuck there. Got a ding, 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 ding. Where is that ding, 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 ding? Why are you auto-saving? Oh, I'm getting closer. Oh, 
Can I see? Is there like a map? Hold on. M. Ah, okay. It's the Oak Lab. Oh, okay. So my base is there. That's a field station. Mysterious machine. Ice cap mix. Tropical puncho. Old Antil. Welp flavoured drink. Raspberry. Okay, so there's something in this direction that it's showing me. Oh, I've never really utilised the map before. But it's telling me to go that way. Okay. Oh wait, a trout! Oh, okay. This is interesting. There's a trowel there. Oh, and more thistles. And a load of mites. Okay. Okay, this is something interesting. But what's in there, though? What's down in that? What is that bug? Y'all see that? There's like a green. I'm going to go on the limb and say that bug is not friendly. And there's nowhere for me, for me to really go. Oh, I see that this is a brand new area. I don't know if that bug's big enough to actually rustle the grass. Okay, so if I can try and... can't get on that rock. Hmm. Complete trial marker, trial gulch. Well, there's a trial, like, right there. So... Yeah, I know, I can see that. Threat detected. Alright, well, they're coming. It's not the only bug that's coming. Hmm. Is this like... Okay, that's the bird. Is this like the second area of the game? Oh my god, man. Dude, my natural fears, yeah, trying to, like, really, are really trying to push me back. Jesus Christ, man. Okay, well, there's a ladybug there. Okay, come here, you bloody mite dude. Okay, I don't see anything. That may cause me any issues. That bug is definitely not going to be friendly. There's no reason for it to. Most, if not all, insects are carnivorous. Think maybe it might be a good time to test the bow? don't know if here's a good... Oh, hang on. Can I pick that up? I don't know if here's a good vantage point. Because ideally I want to shoot it from a place where it can't get me. Okay, well look. There's the hedge right there. You can see it. Okay. Oh. Get back up there. Do you think it could get up me up here? thing is, I can't see it though. Go. Oh. Okay. It's, it's all about the high ground. Okay, maybe if I can try and, like, attract the tension of the, uh... Seven. If I, like, try and throw... 
it down there. It's just the one bug, isn't it? Like... Where is it? R. It's like down there. Come on. I want to see how powerful this bow is as well. Because if it's like really powerful and I haven't been using it the entire time. Because obviously. So where is. Hang on. M. It's like. That way. Okay, that is a lot of health. Oh. It spit something. Um, scary. Oh, okay. Um, oh my god, look at how much damage he did to my health. Look at my health, by the way. I swear my health was full. Like, and now look at it. How are you meant to play this game? How do you fight? Like this is this is also another thing. Like I know my weapons aren't good enough. How do I do better? Okay, so I'm gonna go, and I think because I now have a lot of plant fiber, I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna make acorn uh, shin guards or whatever they're called. More armor protect myself. I lost arrows as well. I never got all my arrows back, by the way. <laughs> I just remembered that because like, I just... Sh the amount of arrows I just shot into, even my... You see so we're now back home. It's, it's almost as if we haven't actually done anything today. Oh my god. Right. Cool. So now I'm wearing pretty decent protection. It's just my weapons. I was kind of hoping I could probably find lavas. Because I remember seeing them, and they drop like fangs and like glands or like something like that. And I remember I found them like in the ground. They are like, like the grubs. They are in the ground. And normally that's where I would find them, but... Uh, this is annoying. Like everything just kills me. Really fast. I can't do anything about it. How do I get better? This is something I'm going to have to look up because this has been going on for a long time and I know not a lot has happened. I just want better stuff so I can at least have a chance because right now, I don't have a chance but I feel like I need to... I need to have the stuff to kill. Or do I just not kill in this game? Like, do I just have to run and avoid? Right, I need to press M as well. Right. So we need to go there. Was that where it was? Okay, well, there's a ladybug here. Does that mean it's safe? Okay, there's something else rattling behind there, and I don't think it's a ladybug for some reason. Okay, I see the trowel. I've come in at a different angle, which is a little bit concerning. Whoa, no, no, no. Can they climb up here? Okay, that bug is back down there. Whoa! Okay, they can climb up here. Threatening, well, I mean, they do jump. I can only imagine a giant spider might pounce as well. I do not want that to ever happen. That is going to be beyond scary. I will not play this game ever again if that happens. Oh, wait. Yes, I can. I did it. What am I looking for? Where is... Yo. Okay, now it's telling me to go south. Which, where is it? 
Where is South? How do I tell? What's that? What's that? Super Tech Chip. Oh, it actually tells me where that is. Where is that? Alright, is that where I'm looking? So if I look this way. Hang on. Is that. Okay. So if I look that way towards the hedges. This is the hedge. Okay, I think I've I think I've understood the map. Okay. This part, this little L shape shape thing where the super chip is, it's in the hedge. That is the hedge. Okay, so I think I've worked out. So the house the house is south. Away. So I'm looking at the hedge right now. So yeah, the house is south. And the shed is north. Okay, so I think I'm now starting to understand. Alright, navigation. Okay, I think I'm starting to understand. Okay. So the super chip is over there. Like, in the hedge. Over there. That is... Oh, my God, man. I'm getting the shivers. My hair is standing up. Okay, so I'm here at the trail gulch. Wait, wait, I'm so confused. Complete trail marker. Oh, so I need to put a trail marker. Ah, oh, I think that's what that means. So I can make that, can't I? A trail marker. Construct. Is that not it? Complete trail marker at Trail Gulch. Well, there's the trail right there. Oh, bro, what is this game? What is it doing to me? I've been playing this game for way too long. It's just the fact that I haven't really done any progress. Well, I mean, we've explored. We've discovered the trowel gulch. Like, that's a trowel. Like, right there. I guess a gulch is something that's, like, in there. Do I have to put the marker in there? I have to defeat that bug. That's what this is. This is to see if I can defeat the bug, and I can't. So, obviously, I need something to defeat the bug, and then I can put the trowel marker down. The super chip is in the hedge. So, I have to go to the hedge regardless. Like, that is a thing. There is a lot of noise going on below me, and I can't see anything. Um, I'm tempted to just wait here for the rest of the night. Yeah, we're going to camp right next to my trail marker. Apparently, I'm, I'm at the trail gulch, but I'm not. It's kind of annoying. Uh, what is that? Oh my god, is that like a light bug over there? Oh, wow. Well, that's actually kind of cool. Cool. Oh, the bee is like right there. I mean, granted, I am near a thistle flower. Okay, well, I'm going to go and end this episode here. It has been like an interesting one, but not obviously not. I say not eventful. I've just run around. I'm exploring, and I think I've understood the navigation. I, I've got. I've understood the map. Okay, I now know how the map. I know. I didn't know of a map, but I now know of a map. So then, my navigation skills will come into play a lot better than they have since I'm literally just walking into nothingness. And now it is now night time, I'm here, and I can't really do anything. Can I, I can't build a lean-to. I need clover leaves, I haven't got any. Oh, I'm kind of doomed to literally just sit here and just pray. But that is what I'll be doing. So yes, until then.